where now look at what we have here this must be the uh bits of uh weapons that our good sir berto was uh, talking about i have no need for that or that i will take all of this oh do you know how i like my model spaceships huh i think in there how about in here all right Well, it looks like I do need to break some stuff. All right. So all we got to do is find ourselves a way inside. Correct. How close are we to that grave site? We're mighty close. Let's see. What else did they want us to do? So where exactly is this place? Or oh, we're actually right there, huh? Wait, how about this? Miss Nyoka, I did say that we were gonna go ahead and do your gravesite thing first. So let's head on over there, shall we? I think we all just gotta continue along the little road here. And we should be there before too long, right? Hey, Felix, I tried your recipe, you know. You tried my Rizzo's Purple Berry Candy Vodka? Be honest, great drink or greatest drink? It's a mite sweet for my taste, but it ain't bad. Gave me a headache, something awful the next morning. Yeah, the formula's a work in progress, but I'm close to a breakthrough. Figure I should add more sugar. The headache's on account of the sugar content. You want to get fancy? Find yourself a tarot. They've got sweet blood, but it ain't so full of sugar. Tearaway blood. Got it. What makes it so sweet? You know, next time I hunt one, I'll have to ask. All right, here we go. All right, Miss Nioka, go ahead and light him up, please. Miss Nioka, I do believe we need to upgrade your armor a little bit. Focus on the Mana Queen. Take out the greatest threat. Oh. Alright, looks like that one will retreat. Food addiction. Can't seem to stop yourself from eating. Even food that's bland or horribly flavored. Not eating often will cause withdrawals. Well, let us see. You know what? I think I will take that. Eating's always good. And let's see. We're all right. All right, we're gonna hide out here for a little bit. Count your ammo. Get yourself set. We'll be headed back out there in two minutes. All right, you two go ahead and follow me. We got some mana queens to uh, hunt. And I do see one right there. Only question is, where did that drone go? All right, Miss Nyoka, go ahead and light her up, please. I am a Watch out for that burn. Go ahead, stun it. Keep the focus fire on it. All right, get the soldier taken care of. Mr. Felix, go ahead, drop it. There you go. 
All right, Miss New Yorker, go ahead, stand on up. All right. That's some mighty fine shooting there. Now, where are we supposed to go? Where's this gravesite? It's not over there. Whoops. It's all good, sir. Oh, I know, madam. Almost stepped right on you. Oh, we got some. I've got a stash over here. An auto mag pistol. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. All right. I suppose that we're heading further down the uh, hill here. Oh, we got some marauders. All right, keep your eyes peeled. We don't want to. We don't want to run into any marauders. Okay, I see two drones. Oh, I see a drone and I see a soldier. All right, Miss Nyoka, go ahead, get rid of that one, please. Go ahead, stun before it gets to Miss Nyoka. There's a drone right up here in my face. If you could please do something about it. All right, good job, Miss Nyoka. You actually stayed alive for this one. All right. Go ahead. Get your ammo count. We're gonna keep on going. I do believe that we are getting closer. Although, of course, there'd have to be some more mana souls along the way. I see two drones. But that's all I see. We'll wait up here for just a moment. Make sure that there's nothing else coming our way. And then we'll take him out. Oh, be careful on these rocks. They might have slipped it. Alright, go ahead. Take him out. Right, you don't mess with the A team. Here we go. Continue on further down the hill. I think the grave site should be down here. On. They're actually the same as my ass kicking boots. I can't afford another pair. You don't say. It is a truck, isn't it? Almost like we don't have the working lifts or roads. Well, that is, there is that, I do suppose. Now that you mention it. Okay, I see some mana saw like beings over there. And there's the gravesite. Alright. Got ourselves a mana saw soldier. Alright, let's go ahead and secure the perimeter. And then we'll head on down through. We'll start with the drone. Good job, Miss Nyoka. I am a One down. Oh, go ahead, drop kick it. Uh, everyone all right? A mighty fine, Mr. Felix. Mighty fine. Alright, good job with that drop kick. I did not see him coming at all. 
All right, so I see wrapped it on Colossus and some Spitters. I think we're gonna have to take out the Spitters first. All right, Miss Nyoka, get the big one. Covering you. Go ahead, drop kick it. Keep it back. Protect Miss Nyoka. Where would that came from? All right, good job. Half off for everybody. All right, Miss Nyoka, we're here at the graveside. Go ahead and do what you need to do, and let's get on out. Buried near the surface of Hale's grave is a small lockbox. Its hinges rusted through and its wood almost completely rotted. It nearly falls apart in your hands, but in it, you manage to find the tarnished silver medallion bearing the letters Chiron. Sorry, Miss Nyoka, I had to go ahead and narrate all of that for you. Alright, Miss Nyoka, I do believe this belongs to you. Hayes was the best self-sacrificing son of a saint I ever met. Halcyon is worse off without him. Now, if we're gonna lure the Manta Queen out, we'll need to find Rebecca and Anders. They took a UDL contract on Terra 2, and we never heard from them again. I think it's time I call in a favor with Hiram. If anyone can track them down, it's him. And uh, why exactly do we need their help? I mean, we are the A-team after all. I mean, I'm pretty sure that we can, you know, handle all of the Manta Queens and whatnot like we did on the way here. The queen ain't just gonna come out on her own. She'll have dug tunnels into the mountain. I've got theories about how to lure her out, but Anders would know for sure. And uh, they took out this UDL contract then? I don't know much about it. It paid well, so they took it. They said they'd be back in a couple of weeks and that maybe we could all use the money to get off Monarch. That was a long time ago. Well, you didn't try to find them or anything like that? I mean, you're all good friends, right? I should have. I, I really should have. But soon after they left, Hayes and the others died. And to be honest, after him, I, I stopped trying. Because it hurt like hell to do so. Well, I am glad that you're trying to confront it instead of, you know, hiding behind it, so I guess. Thanks. I'm still not convinced I won't come to regret it, but we've started down this path. Might as well see it through. Maybe it'll stop me screaming at night. Now come on, let's make tracks before Hiram dies of old age. Alright, let's go. But first we're gonna have to go see the information broker. You do understand. I guess we got a long track. Hawk back up the hill. Uh, Mr. Felix, make sure you tighten your little hiking ass kicking boots, okay? All right. It looks like we're back. There you are. Boss man said you'd be up this way. Quick regroup before we shoot up the place. If you're living up in a tower on a place called Devil's Peak, you might be some type of serial villain. To be honest, I'm surprised it's still standing. Every time I set foot inside, I half expect the tower to fall over. Now, now, we're here to help out these uh, good sirs and madams uh, retake the tower, you see. So, uh... Fox radioed ahead. Said I'm to follow you. Provide whatever support you need. If those bastards start shooting, we'll join in. I gotta warn you, my girl Sunshine here is a tad trigger happy. Of course, me and her will follow your lead. Just wanted you to know we wouldn't begrudge you of any violent inclinations. Well, that is my fine to hear. So, uh, no need to wait on me. Uh, we'll go after you. You're A-OK, -okay, stranger. Hear that, Hudson? It's payday. We'll back you up. Uh, that does not look right. All right. Let's go ahead and get prepared for this one. Waste of company 
Well, that was uh, easy. Watch the uh, watch the cliff right up there. Gotta go ahead and blind one so he can't do anything to us. Watch out, there's a sniper up there. Watch out, sniper. I'm mom trying to take him out. All right, sniper's taken care of. All right. I think that's it. I think we got the whole entire perimeter on the wraps here. I'm sorry about the, the y'all blowing apart body. It wasn't my intention to do that to you. That's an explosive. Let's not stay at it for too long. All right. Oh, somebody got disintegrated. Alright, that was mighty fine shooting from the one of the three of you. Oh wait, never mind, the robot was the third one. The fighting ain't gonna get easier on the inside. Best hurry before the marauders regroup. We'll keep watch out here. Oh you will, will ya? Alright. Miss Nyoka, Mr. Felix, you're with me. We're gonna go ahead and retake the inside. Well look at there. We could go inside through there. What is out here? Hiram must have sealed the door. He's he spooks easy. You don't say. Well, I mean, it might have saved his life. So uh, who am I to complain about that? And that ladder goes right back down. All right. So it looks like there's only one way in, and we're gonna have to go ahead and uh, head on through. Keep your weapons at the ready. Hopefully they don't have any auto mechanical robot fiends. Can't. We'll see. Sorry to interrupt you in the middle of your response there, but uh All right, get that vandal, Miss Nyoka. Felix, don't stand in the way. To shreds, you say? All right, good. Doesn't look like we alerted the rest of the whole complex, which is exactly what I was uh, trying to uh, accomplish. So, good job, team. Look and loot while we got the time. Frozen dinner all in one. Well, that looks mighty fine. Fried chicken, mashed spectrum potatoes, and spice mock apple. I will gladly take that. Let's get some real meat in here. In this here belly. Especially now that I'm addicted to food. I mean, I had always known I was addicted to food, but, uh, you know, I was always a beef jerky, uh, hoarder. Here's the elevator, but it ain't gonna budge while this place is on lockdown. Well, you don't say. Yes, we keep moving forward. Look for another way up. Why well, don't you two go ahead and do that? I'm gonna spend some time here at this vending machine. Or at least just for a little bit. Let's see. What are we gonna sell? I mean, I am carrying the most. Alright. So that's blocked. So what else can we go? Alright. Looks like we got ourselves a room here. I could go ahead and pick that. Let's go ahead and make sure that we're not going to get interrupted. Let me check this bathroom first. Incoming! Well, exactly as I thought. Somebody was taking a crap in the toilet. The vermin. I think we're just going to go ahead and break that down. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, pick our way inside of this here. 
weapons cache looks like. Make sure there's nothing around that's gonna spook me yet again. See a little Marauder taking a crap in here. All right, look and loot, people. Got some elite trooper armor. Uh, Miss Nyoka, your weapon. Remind me, is it a, a long weapon? Looks like it's a heavy weapon. Lot machine gun, modified to do plasma damage, of course. So what if we got you some new armor? Will that help you out some? Still some block. Tick. Lock pick. Definitely don't want to get rid of your stealth. So I guess we're just going to give you the helmet then. There you go. Get you some nice fancy little face plate for that pretty face of yours. And we'll just call it right there. Bob, the new environmental control terminal is now installed and running upstairs. Congratulations, you message corporate about it. You get to manage it. Consider this your official notice to hide its access keycard deep in the bottom of a drawer somewhere, preferably within the archives or in one of the station's other popular sections. Because I sure as hell will not allow our station's efficiency scores to plummet due to a pointless safety feature. Don't even think about testing the system out. The emergency sirens will make your ears bleed, and if you accidentally trigger the fire suppression system, it can suck the air from the room faster than the station's last performance review. Val. Well, looky here. We got the environmental controls key card. Let's go ahead and take that with us. Wasn't there something that I could use this on back in the other room? Oh, no, wait. Never mind. Everything is sealed off anyways. So it doesn't even matter. All right. Keep your eyes peeled. I do believe there are going to be some more marauders. Right. It does not mean there, whoever you are. Yes, yes, I can see you. Come here and talk to me. Face the intercom. Uh, excuse me. I do not see anybody in this uh, room. If you could come out and uh, show me where you are. Um, excuse me. I can't tell if you're brave or simply touched in the head. What in the galaxy are you doing sniffing around my station? Unless you are, in fact, trying to suicide by Marauder? And you, Nioka, what are you doing lugging a stranger into my station? You could use the socialization, you son of a bitch. Also, he hired me. To what purpose? I happen to have some significant problems I am dealing with right now. Marauders, running out of purpleberry wine three days ago, not being able to bloody broadcast. Well, uh, you see, I need to see the information broker about... As I said, there are bigger problems threatening my life and livelihood at this very moment. The Marauders want me dead. And since my hired hands have clearly turned idle, it appears I need you to clear out the threat. As my newest contractor, you may call me... The Broker. Or we can call you Hiram, on account of that's your damn name, and doubly on the account of The Broker being a dumbass alternative. What? Everyone calls me that. Aside from you... And now me. So, uh, anyways, I'm working with Berthold. Uh, C3 is ready to fight, and uh, we just kind of all storming and taking Marauders out one by one. Oh, now they'll take action. It's about time, I tell you. I'm up to my neck and Marauders in here, which, by the by, they were supposed to prevent. I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the Marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. Where? They destroy the transmission equipment, and I'll be out of business. The elevator and doors to the second floor are back online. Hurry before I have to lock them down again. Well, now that is what I'm talking about. Um, I'll see what I can do then. You hear that? We're getting paid. Doubly so. All right, heavy ammo right there. Already looked into there. Let's see, what is behind here? Nothing. 
All right, excuse me, Mr. Felix. All right, you heard the band. The uh, elevator door is now open. Elevators to your right. Get ready. C3 is entering through the main doors as we speak. About damn time. All right, let's head on up there and let's get rid of some marauders, let's say. Are you ready? Here we go. Oh, you both might want to get your weapon of choice out. Light him on fire, ladies and gents. Well, uh, let's see here. All right, look alive, people. Don't mess We're entering up. a combat zone. But don't mind me. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, pick at everything while everybody else is doing the fighting. Is that it? Do we do it? Let's see. Inclement weather warning. Regional service alert. Severe alert. Next 72 hours. Chance of thunderstorms and severe thunderstorms, including lightning strikes, forecast across the mountain region. Let's see. From V. Ramsey, subject emergency protocols. As I stated in my prior four messages, there is simply no cause for alarm. I swear to you, Hiram, the situation is under control. What you call a near emergency, I would consider a non-event. Yes, a high energy transmission was used for too lengthy a period of time. And yes, the generators cannot safely support that activity. Yes, and yes, they could have been damaged under load. But the point remains. Nothing happened. We caught the issue in time. The engineers involved were reprimanded. I swear on my mama's grave, it will not happen again. Now, please con now please cease contacting me for the daily updates on the status of the generators. Thank you. Toilets. What in the black hole were you thinking, Val? At some point, space efficiency becomes the inverse of time efficiency, and one negates the other. What I mean is, how am I supposed to do my morning business when the toilets are directly facing the open showers? You might like watching fellows fellas scrub their jigglies while you take a streaming dump but i do not thanks for the peep show not really that was sarcasm theodore on the contract on the contrary theo not only is it a specially efficient design but it also encourages simultaneous users to hurry their um business don't like it don't look or speed it up and move on after all the faster you're back to your station the happier we will all be warmest regards val postscript you take too many bathroom breaks and you know it, you damn fool. Well, all right then. We'll let C3 do their uh, job and then we'll pick up the uh, stragglers, let's just say. That wasn't me uh, alluding that we were going to stop betraying people. <laughs> Your cut looks pretty. What? Something's not right. Oh, you right uh, excuse me? Did you not take out all of the uh, Marauders yet? Well, don't mind me. Go ahead and take him out. We'll be there in just a second. Well, uh-oh. Uh, that don't look too good at all. Let's see. I guess that means that they have, uh, met with an unfortunate end. Let's just say. They couldn't even take out a damn ringleader. All right. Miss Nyoka, if you would please finish this burning fool off. Disintegrate him. Miss Felix, do not stand in front of me when I'm aiming. Thank you. Alright, poor fools, but at least we get all of the, uh, all of the goods, let's just say. Well, look at what we have here. Let's just take a look see on at my own armor. I do love that quite a bit. 
I like that quite a bit more than what I got on me. Uh, but the color, oh, the color though, could use a little bit of some improvement. You know what? Blue and yellow is my color of choice. Sorry, but I think I'm just gonna have to give this one to Mr. Felix. Mr. Felix, I do believe I have some new armor for you. So, uh, here you go. You're on the front line way more than I am. So, uh, there you go. Have some fun with that one. And Miss New Yorker, you'll of course be wearing your own armor for the time being. All right. Well, thank you, thank you. Are you Mr. Hiram? Let's talk. I never thought I'd be ecstatic at having the walls painted in blood, but seeing as it's not mine, I'd say this calls for a celebration. And you got me my money's worth out of the C3s. I ought to have simply dealt with you in the first place. Well, think nothing of it. I am here for the payment, though. Oh, no. My business is in trade, not owing others the burden of a favor. This ought to square our debt. One hefty payment for highly valued service rendered. But I admit, I do wonder why Nioka has brought you to me. Allow me to pose my question in another manner. Why, in the nebula, are you here? Well, I told you, uh, I'm looking for a certain information broker. Ah, yes. Our little chat on the intercom. You're looking for the premier broker for all of Monarch, which you knew was me, clearly. Yes. Phineas must have sent you. He's the only one insane enough to send someone to Monarch to rush me. I knew it was only a matter of time before he came a-knocking. Look, I might be late, but I fulfill my contracts always. Oh, you do, do you? I have lost track of the number of beers you owe me for chasing Raptodons off your stoop. Have you seen Doc Wells? The guy's ancient. You take any more time and he's liable to croak. I take offense to that. Look, okay. Just, it might take me a while this time. And, uh, why is that exactly? I am awaiting but a single incoming transmission containing the information we desire. But MSI and the Iconoclasts are clogging the airwaves from Stellar Bay and Amber Heights. In their war against each other, they're scrambling each other's outgoing transmissions. So, uh, I guess we kick them off or something? I don't know how all this works. This is all scientific jargon, and I'm not a very educated man in that regard. Exactly what I was thinking. They hurt us all with their pettiness. Which, of course, has inadvertently affected the incoming port and my livelihood. So, uh, we just cut them off from inside the station then? No, they're jamming the limited frequencies we have at our disposal. Nothing extraplanetary can get in or out until the frequency pollution thins out. The safest bet is to convince Graham and Sanjar to stop transmitting on their end. So I guess, uh, we'll just talk some sense to them then. You do that, I'll be here waiting on the receiving end. Luck be with you. I have a feeling you'll be needing a pinch of it, plus a vat of patience. Also, uh, Nioka, I'll turn this one over to you, but I believe Nioka needs a favor. Oh, great. I love doing pro bono work for friends. Aw, you called us friends. I'd normally entertain your self-aggrandizing delusions, but this time it's important. Important to you is not the same as important to me. Although I do recognize that you may have earned some goodwill during your months laboring for me. Well, uh... She is your friend, and she is in need. You're the only one who can help us, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Tug on my heartstrings, why don't you? Look, I'll do what I can, all right? Rebecca Hodges and Anders Wattsworth. They took a UDL contract back when Monarch went to ship, and I need to find them. I believe them to be on Terra too. If UDL hired two hunters back then, it would have been for creature clearing purposes round one of their spacer's choice outposts. 
These are the coordinates for the outpost under the last UDL contract. Now scram. And, uh, good luck. All right, then. I guess we have everything we need. We'll be heading out. Be a doll and shoot any marauders you spot on the way down. Well, uh, if you're gonna give me 2,000 more bits, then of course I would be more than happy to oblige. All right, Mr. Felix, Miss Nyoka, looks like we have ourselves a new heading, so let's head on out. Huh. You see what I did there?